All right, everyone, this is an update. I uh, built my uh, SSG circuit, and it worked. And I went ahead and added six more to this uh, crazy circuit. It looks pretty uh, interesting. Uh, but it's working. Working good. Worked good with just one. So I went ahead and uh, wrapped a, a six filer, I believe that's how it's pronounced, coil here. I got it all uh, on these nice little terminal blocks so I can mess with them. And uh, right now I'm charging this little battery. I think it's a 7 amp hour. Uh, it's running off of an 18 amp hour, what I had. Got a power supply hooked up to it because it dropped pretty low on voltage lately and uh, I just need to recharge it. But uh, yeah, it's, uh, it picked up some RPM with more coils. Um, it went up quite a bit. It's still not as fast as I thought it would be, but uh, it, it's working pretty good. I did wrap some uh, bigger size wire on my uh, coil and tried it out. I didn't really like it. Uh, I don't know if it's just not set up right or what, but right now it's doing pretty good. And uh, yeah, I see. Show you my uh, messy basement. I got a really old oscilloscope here, which uh, still works. I uh, just uh, kind of play around with it. It probably needs to be calibrated and stuff. It's it's pretty old. Uh, in case you were wondering, this is what my circuit looks like. Um, let's see if you can get it all in there. Um, that's what I got. It's a regular SSG circuit, but I just have six of them. And uh, all the outputs are going to the same battery. So I'm getting I'm getting pretty good charging. Uh, it was okay before. Now it's a lot better though. Um, I think this battery's been charging for, I don't know, a day and a half, uh, something like that. In case you were wondering how long this took to solder up, believe it or not, um, it didn't take very long at all. Uh, I believe I soldered this up in about three hours. Uh, that's including mounting, mounting the uh, transistors and uh, drilling holes in the uh, the uh, plate here, uh, just the insulator plate, and uh, soldered these wires on here and checked them, and uh, built this entire circuit, soldered it all up uh, in about three hours, which was good, I was cruising along, uh, surprisingly, but uh, like I said, it's kind of a 3D mess of uh, wires here, but nothing, you know, nothing's touching that shouldn't be, everything's, everything's working got my neons on there also but uh, pretty cool and they're all individual circuits the the common collectors back here they're not touching each other everything's separate they're not they're not on the uh, heat sink or anything they're all separate it took me a little while to try to find that uh, find out where they were or not but uh, it's been running for a couple days now pretty good I want to show you my messy uh, my messy workshop here this is built out of connects and I actually wrap my uh, my coils, get them all twisted up, and wrap them around here, nice and big, nice and easy to work with. And then uh, took my drill and hooked up my small coil uh, right here, my uh, my bobbin coil wire there, and uh, wrapped around here first, and then wrapped it on there. Built out of connects. Uh, this wheel actually I had for a long, long time, and I just built this base real quick just to hold it. But uh, yeah. Just interesting. Here's my uh, workshop lately from these past experiments. I uh, I haven't cleaned up anything. It's just a disaster. But hopefully tonight or tomorrow or something I can uh, I can figure it out. How I did to make these wires? I actually stretched them all the way down my driveway, wrapped them around a post, and stretched them all the way back. Got them all stretched really tight, and then I just soldered. Kind of hard to see. I just soldered the end together here. So all these wires, there's seven of them. Six are power and one is the trigger. I just soldered them together on the end. Went all the way down the driveway and all the way back. Hooked it onto my car on both ends. And then uh, took the drill, wrapped it around a nut or a bolt. And uh, put it in the drill and twisted it. I probably should have twisted it a lot more than I did. But I just wanted enough to hold the wires together. Um, might be kind of hard to see but... 
They're just enough to hold the wires together. They're not really twisted that much. Um, I probably should have done it more, but uh, it's working pretty good. I really don't know. They say it's better if you twist them a bunch, and some people say it's not. I really don't know if it is or not. Uh, maybe one day I'll experiment with twisting it more and see if I get a better charge out of it. But yeah, hopefully I'll start my load testing here. Um, and uh, right now i still got my potentiometer in there. I need to make sure it's tuned. I did not check it for tune yet. I just wanted to see. uh want to get it running. It was late. And uh, it's going. What do you want, kitty? Huh? Hungry. All right, I'll go feed the cat. You guys enjoy? And uh, I'll give you an update if I ever do some more. But yeah, there's the circuit. Enjoy. See you guys.